Hey guys, it's my son here. Ah, oh, boy, okay, so I hope you guys are all doing well here. You know, I given what's currently going on here across the across the globe here, you know, making sure you're all wash, washing your hands and everything like that. And are enjoying yourself while being stuck at home here, quarantined here. I know I am. <laughs> Uh, so, yes, a lot of things are happening right now today. I mean, currently, they're still going on the uh, PS5 hardware reveal. Like, literally right here, live presentation, everything like that on my... Right there, you can see two Joe Raptor and a young, young, young Yi doing that as well. And, yeah, also, people, I've uh, started watching... Infinity Train, book one. So, tell me, does it, does it just, like, cut off right there after the episode here? Like, is, is there no uh, credits or anything like that? Huh. That was weird, because that was kind of abrupt, abrupt for me. It's like, wait, am I missing something? Also, yeah, I hope you guys are okay and healthy and enjoying your time here, playing a lot of video games here. I've been playing a lot of Destiny Season of the Worthy, trying to... Increased by bunker and everything like that, and trying to get now the fourth horseman. But another gaming news here: we got this right here. The drop today, a new origin story for the character we have seen twice, technically three times. Like the first time here, the whole like that tra that uh, cinematic in the museum, seeing Doomflix, Doomfix, Doomfix Gauntlet. We saw like the entire. Like, Overwatch portrait there, and maybe they explain the readers why she looks different there and here, but yeah, we also saw her in the uh, Gunslinger cinematic with, well, with uh, McCree and Ash. <laughs> and of course, in the um, prologue for the war here with like no voice, just came in. Yes, it's Echo. We finally see the origin story of Echo right here. I can't wait. I've so far my Discord people say it's emotional. Let's see. Okay, good, good, good. Ooh. Echo Origins. Okay. Lower it down a bit more. Ooh, ooh, damn! My ears. They breached the line and won't stay back. Okay, that's that. This is it. Did did I make the world a better place? Omnica Corporation. Omnica Corporation. The Omni Crisis, how it. had every reason to doubt me. Oh boy. You should join us. But I helped create the Omnics. And who better to help us fight them? And only Overwatch believed. You are my life's work. Echo! You will be everything I dreamed. All I wanted. All I needed was to help the world. Was to what? Was and I... so she created me. Her legacy. Ah. Her promise. Her echo. Interesting. Let's see. Mm, getting from... I love that the wing can be done with a chair. Oh, I love that cool design. So, yeah, it, it seems that I gotta bother to just explain why the her she looks different here. It's just redesign everything like that. Okay, whatever. We, that doesn't matter. But, yeah, okay, it seems from what I got from this, all right, at, at the end there, it seems a doctor right here. This is a beautiful idea. I love, I love this scene. It seems her personality is built up. Echo's personality is built around the personality of of her, of her creator here. Pretty much, you could say it's similar to uh, Halsey Cortana situation here. Like how they make smart AIs in Halo. All right. I mean, I thought an exact copy, but that's what I'm getting at here. Like possibly. Mimicking her mind. Yeah, I've seen this in many sci-fi here. I oh wow, all over the place. I mean, hell, 
Uh, look at Mac Cross Plus with uh, Sharon Apple. There you go. And yeah, okay. So that was nice. Obviously, the nice image of Echo. Okay, yes. Hmm. I like how the wings are clearly flexible here from form of uh, obviously a form of uh, uh, memory metal, memory alloy, M memory alloy and uh, flex polymers and fibers. Impressive. I just I like how she, her movements. <laughs> so yeah, that that was cool. That was cool. Uh. Definitely want a comic of the doctor here. Sorry, of the dot of her creator here. Just seeing how like she joined up. Like, did she foresee? Like, did she almost predict this was gonna happen? But no one here believed her. Overwatch reaching out to her to okay. Yeah, it's gotta happen. I mean, I'm I'm assuming she's one of the few survivors that of of the creators of cre Omni creators. All right. Of course, there's just the explanation of what happened here. It's like, what were the Om were Om I'm guessing the Omnic attacks and okay, but by then it was too late. She they all she already finished Echo and voila. Nice. So yeah, very deep. A, a lot of little backstory here. I love. I mean, it just three. It just less than two minutes. Let me see here. We not counting the uh, the final scene here with Echo here in less than a minute and in less than ninety seconds. They told a very compelling, interesting origin story about Echo and her, her creator and everything. So wow, yeah. And the artwork is beautiful. Just the, oh wow, yeah. And I want no more. I can't wait for Overwatch Two to come out. But I can. I got plenty of other games to play. Like wow, you can see a stack right there, mostly PS, PS Four, and I currently have an issue with my PS Four Pro. In which, from what I gather, hard drive mechanical failure. Good thing I stored everything to the to the the cloud. Whew. But yeah, I'm interested. I, I can't wait. I <laughs> this is gonna be fun. So yes, everyone, thank you all. Blizzard, okay, yeah, Blizzard going through some massive like wow. EA, Activision, and Blizzard, especially after like the whole Warcraft reforged debacle. It's like. Wow, and what's going on right now? So I, before we ever get like expanded universe stuff, like a comic or books, I will buy. But I have bought. I got some StarCraft books printed out loud here, like the entire. I got. I managed to get the freaking um, Ghost Academy manga, all three volumes here. I managed to find, just because I was reading like a Spectre and Ghost and stuff like that. So yeah. Make a book of Overwatch. I will buy it. But first, try to sort out your mess. But yeah, great, great little animation here. I'm glad for it here. Ah. This is good. This is a, a nice little uh, bright spot here in this current, like, uh, crisis we're all having. Ah. So, everyone, thank you for watching. As always, come to blow, come to blow what you all thought. Like and subscribe for more. And remember to wash your hands. <laughs> Until then, this is Mekasan, and I've officially dated this video by in a few years, <laughs> or a few months. <laughs>